Greetings, I am Takur. Welcome. I have just come to tell you that the meetings that are coming up very shortly, if any of you want to volunteer to speak or be a part of them, please let me know. And I will add you to the roster. There are some of you, such as Sheer and Liney and others, Christine, that are already on the rosters. But if any of any others of you want to uh, come along, and JD, uh, you're also there, but and Ellie, um, many of you um, can volunteer just to be there. You do not have do not have to speak if you do not want to, but just to have you there as a support. Uh, for the group would be nice. Are there any questions? All right, I believe we're running out of time. No, yes. we have time, we have time. We have one. Takara? Yes. This is Marlene. I would like to be part of the roster, please. And who is this? It's Marlene. Marlene, thank you. We will add you to it. Thank you. Uh, me too, me too, me too. Oh, Max, you're already on the roster. Of course, thank you. Yes, you would like to be part of it. Okay, there's, okay, there's a question in the room here. One moment. Please come closer. Uh, I just wanted to know um, if you could just give us a, uh, a, a brief list of what your topics are going to be. She would like to know a brief list of the topics that will be discussed at the world meetings. Is there, uh, did somebody else say something first? Yeah. All right. Some of the topics that will be discussed will be these. Site-to-site -site transport, medical, bringing people to the ship for medical attention, site-to-site -site also. Um, uh, talks about uh, exchange programs for the future when when finally uh, there are those that are going to want to ex uh, come here and we go there also writing the rules and regulations for this kind of action we are being very proactive and wanting to get these kinds of uh, things done ahead of time but your uh, your Nations are not always very cooperative with that, but we have a couple of the rules already because we've sort of uh, told them what we were expecting and they told us what they were expecting. Other things are what kind of exchange programs for minerals and things that we are are asking for. We also are talking about the hybridization programs the children the children's hybridization program and the serum hybridization program which is taking of dna and turning it into medication for those other species that may need it we're also talking about um non-violent communications with some of these countries because they seem to have uh, the thought that our agenda is to attack or for annihilation of the planet or takeover or something. We always do a start off with a very peaceful agenda, a very treaty-like understanding of why we are there and gathering and of that nature. Also, we, we go over the galactic laws with humanity to let them know what is and is not being done to help them and to keep them in check and to keep the aliens that are not friendly in check. And uh, we talk about the Prime Directive also and how that works with humanity. We go over many of these things every time that we speak to the to humanity because it is necessary for us to uh, make clear our intentions and how we are working. If there are any changes in our policies with them, we will discuss that. We will ch dis 
discuss anything that they bring up to discuss. And many times it's, uh, they want us to interfere with uh, some of their negative wars or things, but we cannot uh, do that. We cannot, that is part of the prime directive as well. But there are many things that we do discuss with your peoples, and there are probably a couple subjects that I forgot to mention. But that is mostly what we talk about. Is there any other any other uh, things that you believe we should bring up that we haven't mentioned so far? Yeah, uh, the exchange program. You possibly want to offer to exchange uh, politicians or scientists for a visit. Yes, we already mentioned that. Yes, mm -hmm. we do. We do talk to them about the exchange program. And uh, at this time, it's greeted rather coolly, but it's not, it's not one of the topics that is uh, a turnoff, as you will, for some of your countries, but some of them are very interested in that. Thank you. Yeah, it's occur. Yes. There's yeah, something that I think that you should uh, talk about uh, in the government meeting about uh, certain uh, things that are going to come in 2018 that are going to be present here on Earth, you know what I'm speaking about. So oh, I yeah. think that would be a very uh, urgent matter even. Yeah, so, so and I forgot to mention, first contact and, uh, what is the word? Disclosure. I didn't even mention that, but we do discuss that as well. Plus the things that will be happening in the near future, yes. Thank uh, you, Shir. No problem. By the way, um, Ganesh just confirmed us that uh, certain messages about the cabal uh, have been... Um, certain rules and regulations are now expired and the Syrians are going after the cabal. Is it? Syrians form the portion of it the... It is true here? because they have... The problem is, and I must be very careful about how I speak about this, but there have been infractions to galactic law by your people. And so there are those that are being sent to see if this such situation can be straightened out. Okay. And I was, that is the most diplomatic way I can say it. And is it a Syrian I think was much more, uh, said it much better in some ways, but we are more restricted in what we say than Grindel, for we have legal bindings with your countries and in order for us to stay within those legal bonds, we cannot say as much as other aliens, perhaps, could say. And we do not want to be in any trouble with any of your political uh, agendas. Understood. Thank you very, very much. And it's always awesome to me to speak with you. Thank you for coming. Thank you very much. And it is always good to speak to you as well. We are indebted to humanity for your wonderful species is so good in, in many, many ways. And um, I know that um, sometimes it is difficult to deal with us because we try to bring you as much as we can, but we cannot always deliver on some of our promises and we feel bad about that but it is not because we are trying to deceive you in any way but that because sometimes our expectations uh, are too high and your governments are not allowing us to be ourselves in many ways but that is all right we will deal with it for now and move forward Everything will be overcome at some point. It will, and it will be a wonderful time of celebration when all of you have become part of the neighborhood, the galactic neighborhood, I should say, because 
that is what we are really looking forward to because that is when we can actually really talk and be really friends. There are those of you that I am friends with from a distance, from this distance, and there are some of you that can tr transport yourselves astrally to the ships and things of that nature, and so we can speak that way. But talking face to face is what we're really looking forward to. Um, Picker, it's Elena. I greeting. I would say greetings, and I would say um, because I forget to mention this when I come and visit the colonies. Um, I need some hybridization of grades um, on my body in order to in order to to fight up with the weight I've gained because I know it's a bit some of the hybridizations uh, messed up my metabolism and we can help you with that I will come and talk to you I yes. will come and give you a scan and see what is going on most yes. hybridizations do not affect humans in a negative way but only in a positive way but did it mess up your female hormones is that the part that is messed up i would say i became more relaxed and more in a, in a low dimension so this relaxed my metabolism i see we will check it out okay the car much love and i will see you when i see you much love to you. And we will check you out uh, very shortly here. Once you go to bed, which is, you, you are at a later time stamp than this area, so you will be heading to bed sooner than they will. So we will check you out at that time. Ikarakwa ashram vizani, kachabiyata paravati, nokawa kwa senza, eli. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, Secure, the, go ahead. Go ahead. Can I go ahead, Matt? Yes. Yep. Takura, this is Marlene. Um, this will be my first meeting um, uh, as support. Is there any protocol that I should know about prior? We will let you know everything you need to know when you arrive. Thank you. You will not um, be there the whole time because you will only come in the astral. So it will be during your sleep periods. You may be only there for a couple days or you may be there one, uh, all, all days. It's up to you. When we come to pick you up astrally, you will let us know if you are in the right frame to come that day or not. Thank you. Well, I, um, do you think that I would need a harmonization before? No, you will be coming in the astral, which is in your perfect state. There will be no blemishes. The astral body is in the perfect shape, a spiritual shape. So you do not need to make any improvements on the astral. Thank you. You're welcome. It Hi, is good to call. have you aboard. Hello. Thank you, Tekan. Um, You're welcome. I'm sorry, I didn't step on your tongue. That is all right. Um, no. I wanted to come to the astral plane when you have the meeting and also come as an observer for the rest of the time. Is that possible to do so? If that is what you desire, we will come to uh, pick you up at in your sleep periods. Yes, that's what I uh, would like to do for that time frame and observe uh, and to understand the time, uh, understand Correct. the other colleagues. There are many that just go to observe because it just shows that there are many people interested in what the world thinks and in alien uh, friendships and things of this nature. It is good as, with as many humans coming in astral as possible to be seen by the population of your governments. Yes. Thank you. Very well. You uh, mentioned my name. 
Am I there um, only as an observer? Sometimes you do speak, Christine. You have a very strong some things. <laughs> Good thing I don't remember. <laughs> it is all right. You would do a very nice job. You do actually do not care for public speaking, but in the astral, it brings it makes you more relaxed. Thank you. Blessed be. Blessed be. <clears throat> Anyone else? Hey, it's her. Yes. Greetings. Could you please add me to the list? Absolutely, I will. Thank you, and much love. Thank you. You're already there. I have a, I have a blessing for you, Tikar. Can I? Thank you. It is time for blessings. I believe oh. our time is done. Is it uh, not? How about? I think we can do another five ten minutes. Uh, what is? Um, the first question is um, about Slava's mother. So Slava's mother has a health condition, and she needs to decide to take an, to take to undergo a big operation. And uh, yes. Lord, she already advised for that. I uh, I invite your, your your help with her health. We have already uh, are aware of it, and we will send an infusion to help with the safety of the operation. We will not be able to take part in it as such, but we can send some protective energy for when she goes into the operating area. Wow. Thank you much. Um, You're welcome. Another topic is, um, I have that email which I set up three years ago, four years ago, sign up to go at gmail.com right here, right here. And um, several more people asked me if they, you know, about they also volunteer to participate in the meeting in the government meeting on the third. Yes, uh, they three, have been four, three days ago. So I suggest um, you check that email, and I suggest they send the email to that to that address. Yes, they have been included. Anyone who writes and asks for inclusion will be uh, it will be honored. Also, that is on the website down below, hukula.org, there is a menu apply and they can apply through a form. So that could be an anonymous application. They also can apply there. It's also yes, the way to get through all of these things and they are approved. Thank you much. You are welcome. Taka. Yes, Lai. Um, you know, when we go to these meetings, whether we just um, sit on the side or whatever, do um, yes. uh, the other humans actually see us? How do they see us? Or they they see you in astral, just like they see you on the colonies. Oh, okay. Um, I'm talking about the, the, the people from the, the governments. Do they see us or not? And how do they see you, the people of the governments? Yeah, if we go to these government meetings... <clears throat> they see the, that there are many entities there, but they do not see you as, uh, they know that the, you are people, you are in energy spheres, but they do not see you as people until you actually speak, and then they can see ex exactly what you look like. Oh, that, that's really, really interesting. Have I, have I ever personally spoken, just a matter of interest? Only once. And it was about the hybridization program. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. Uh, and they, they do know the identity of the people who participate, right? No, not... They do not know the identities of the people, no. Oh. They do know a few of them because they are people of notoriety in other ways. But for the most part, most people are anonymous. Yeah, I don't think it's that anonymous because you... Well, not for you. You actually announced who you were. <laughs> you have no idea why. You actually, you, uh, there is a few of you that actually, when you spoke, gave your names. And that is all right, too. 
Hope they won't come here and do whatever they want. No, they do. They will not. It is part of the uh, agreement that uh, no one will be harmed or no one will be bothered. No, oh, okay. But if I will meet someone from my government, he could recognize my face. <laughs> Perhaps, since you hmm. since you did speak. Almost every time. No, nope. good to know. Yes, you speak on a lot of topics. Anybody All else? Right. Yes, to curious, Marlene, uh, have I been to those meetings? It seems I can't recall in my mental, but my body and my feeling says that I've somehow been to yes. you many. actually were at the very last one for the first time oh thank you yes but now that you uh, you were actually already on the roster but you asked to be added so I I just said yes but you were already added many people are on there that they some I guess do not even know so I was at the one in December, right? December 2016? Yes. Have I brought up any, any topics? Actually, you wanted to, but you were one of the ones that they did not allow you to speak. You were talking, you wanted to talk a little bit more about the hybridization program, but several people had already spoken about it. And so they did not let uh, the last four people speak. <clears throat> oh, I, I understand. But this time we are wanting everyone to speak, no matter how long it takes. Thank you. That's, uh, <laughs> that's uh, evolving. <laughs> yes. A lot of people wanted to speak on disclosure as well and first contact. That was another very popular subject matter. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Yes, I've, uh, these two topics are also very close to my being. <laughs> yes. Thank Excellent. you. Thank You're you. welcome. I believe, how much more time do you have, Max? I think it's a good time to close up. Wonderful. JD, I believe you have the first blessing. Is there anyone else? Max, did you want to control that? Of course. As I uh, yeah, sure. I will be going. Thank you for your attention. And I hope that I was able to give you some useful information. Yes, thank Much you. Luck. Very nice to have you. Much luck. Namaste as well. Thanks for your time. Namaste.